All right, so uh, it's the bus we're traveling. Obviously, the front stays uh, sort of the coach's area. Um, usually, uh, bunks are determined by uh, games played, usually, or uh, age sometimes. And uh, yeah, so you know, usually coaches and training staff stay up front. They usually get the big TV or little TV, as in this case, this trip. Um, move on here. A couple of these bunks, some of the other uh, younger guys, like Rolly here, uh, occupy these ones. And then uh, we've got a fridge over got here. The best bunk on the bed. Yeah, we wish. Bunk. A little fridge freezer for some snacks if we want to bring some. Uh, then uh, bathroom, a little stinky this road trip, but uh, you know, she does the trick. You gotta do, usually, yeah, no number twos on there, just number ones. Any number twos you get a fine. Uh, usually 50 or $100, I don't even know, to be honest with you. 50. 50. dollars I guess. Um, you know, just some storage for here. Uh, I think there's a microwave up here. Yeah, a microwave hidden in there. And we'll head to the back here. We got, uh, usually on our other buses we've had, uh, they flip down a lot easier, but uh, yeah, as you can see here, boys are just all bumped up right now. Waiting for this long bus trip to get over. Head our way to the back here. So hard. <laughs> Into the back, here we go. This is the main suite that the big boys rock back here. Yeah, we're gonna come back here. Yeah, it's usually the lounge area, but like I said, this is not, uh, not one of our one of our better buses that we've had. So <laughs> usually everything flips up. There's usually two tables, and you know, usually cards and uh, some better activities get uh, done back here. And a uh, nice satellite dish there for the boys to enjoy. Doesn't work, I guess. Um, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. That's about it for the bus. Not much else you can do on here besides uh, sleep and fart and smell it up.